Hey everybody, this is Bart with Great Meals Barbecue, and tonight we're gonna to do a quick breakfast for dinner on the most versatile cooking machine ever designed. You guessed it, the Camp Chef FTG 600. Stay tuned. <music> makes the best pancakes, Nana or Papa? It is. It is. Who? Papa. Papa! <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna go ahead and get our bacon going here. I've got my burners on medium, uh, basically just the left two burners. Actually, the left, all three burners on the left side. The far right I've got turned off right now. I'm just going to use that to uh, keep stuff warm once I finish up here. And you are baking a flip here. Alright, I'm going to get our French toast ready to go here, and I'm only doing three pieces of French toast. My son's the only one that's going to eat it. Um, and what I generally do is I do, if I'm doing three pieces of French toast, I'll use two eggs. And the ratio just seems to work out pretty good. I'm going to get two eggs in here. I'm going to add a, just a splash of milk here. And he likes cinnamon with his French toast. I'm gonna put a little bit of cinnamon in there, and I'll probably put some more in this as I uh, once I get the French toast on the grill griddle. All right, I'm gonna let that set just a couple minutes here. We're gonna go back and check on our bacon. All right, I'm gonna get ready to do the French toast here. What I'm gonna do is just kind of clean off this center section. I've turned it down to low. Keep all that good bacon grease over there for my eggs here in a few minutes. So what I've got here is uh, just two scrambled eggs with cinnamon in here. And I'm gonna just basically real quickly soak the, the bread on each side. I know some people let it soak for several minutes. Um, we just, we don't like it with it soaked all the way through. So this is a quick and easy way to do it. Just gotta make sure you get some moisture on there. And pretty much literally by the time I get the three pieces soaked here and get them on, they're gonna be ready to flip. Got enough egg left over. I'm gonna go ahead and do a fourth piece here. Sun like cinnamon on it, so we're gonna go ahead and add a little extra cinnamon here. Right, let's see what we've got on these two over here. Pretty close to perfect there. Give these two just another minute or so here. And right now I've got the three left burners on all the way down as low as it goes and the right side is off. A 
little salt and pepper on there. French toast should be done. All right, I'm gonna get our French toast off of the heat here. Get the scrambled eggs finished up. over here off the heat and I'm going to actually try to use these uh, ring molds. I've never used them before so we're going to give them a shot and see what happens. I've got a little bit of oil on there to hopefully kind of seal the bottom to keep the uh, egg from falling out of there. Go. Salt and pepper. And I just thought of something I probably should have done. I didn't think to uh, get a little oil on the inside rib, those rings. Well, these are probably gonna stick a little bit here. So let's see if I can save the day here. There we go, got that one. We can save this one over here. All right, we are pretty much done. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get these plated up and we'll be back. And there we have a quick breakfast for dinner. Bacon, French toast, and eggs. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.